क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम गेट टू थाउजेंड सेवेंटीन मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग पेपर सेट वन क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी टू मैच द प्रोसेस विद देयर कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स द प्रोसेस इज गिवन आर पी इज इलेक्ट्रिकल डिस्चार्ज मशीनिंग क्यू इज अल्ट्रासोनिक मशीनिंग आर इज केमिकल मशीनिंग एस इज आयन बीम मशीनिंग द कैरेक्टरिस्टिक गिवन आर नंबर वन नो रेसिडियल स्ट्रेस नंबर टू मशीनिंग ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकली कंडक्टिव मटीरियल्स नंबर थ्री मशीनिंग ऑफ ग्लास एंड नंबर फोर नैनो मशीनिंग लेट्स फाइंड आउट द करेक्ट मैचेस सो द फर्स्ट वन विच इज गिवन इलेक्ट्रो डिस्चार्ज मशीनिंग इन शॉर्ट वी कैन राइट इट एज ईडीएम इन दिस टाइप ऑफ मशीनिंग द इलेक्ट्रिकल एनर्जी इज बींग यूज टू जनरेट स्पार्क्स एंड दीज स्पार्क्स इन टर्न प्रोवाइड द थर्मल एनर्जी टू मशीन द मटेरियल द मटेरियल इज ऑल्सो इलेक्ट्रिकली कंडक्ट and the materials are machined using this process generally are high strength and temperature resistant materials so we can say electro discharge machining matches with option 2 given in the characteristics which is machining of electrically conductive materials p matches with 2 next one q ultrasonic machining the materials that are poor conductors of electricity and generally these materials are also brittle in nature these type of materials are machined using ultrasonic machining such as glass so brittle materials such as glass can be machined using ultrasonic machining and therefore we can say q matches with option 3 that is machining of glass next one r r is given to be chemical machining in this type of machining when the chemical milling of the material is carried out there are chances of occurrence of warping and to prevent warping all the residual stresses in the material from previous processing must be relieved so warping generally is a phenomenon that occurs due to residual stresses and therefore to prevent it we should relieve all the residual stresses and therefore r matches with relieving the residual stresses which is given in option 1 no residual stresses last s iron beam machining this type of machining is a non conventional technology which uses a stream of accelerated ions that are inside a vacuum chamber and these ions because of their electrical charges machine the surface of the object and machining with this technology can be carried out at a very high resolution it can be of the order of 0.1 micrometer so we can say that this technology is used for nano machining and nano machining is given in fourth one so s matches with fourth one let's go back and mark the correct matches 2 3 1 4 we will mark the option with these matches 2 3 1 4 it's given in option a itself option a is correct to learn more about manufacturing processes you can refer to the nptel video description and taxonomy of manufacturing processes this is from the course advanced manufacturing processes the course is by dr ak sharma he is from department of mechanical engineering of iit roorkee I hope this explanation will help you clear your doubt. Thank you.